Seven amazing benefits of having hobbies in retirement. All right. Hey, everyone. Welcome back to Retired Life. Check out the water behind us. Hoo hoo, fish on. I'm mm -hmm. loving it. Too cold to go swimming. Oh, way too cold today. Today's like uh, 65 degrees here. It's supposed to be 90. Now well, they miss that. Today we're going to talk about the seven amazing benefits of having a hobby in retirement. And whether you're already retired or whether you're still planning for retirement, these benefits can make your golden years even better. Even more golden. So grab your favorite beverage, sit back and relax, and let's get into it. Number one benefit to having hobbies in retirement is stress relief. Uh, chronic stress can really take a toll on your body and on your mind. Um, it can cause anxiety and depression and even cause physical ailments. So you don't want to get any of that. No matter what your job was prior to retirement, almost everyone has had a little bit of stress. Even in my simple little job, I, there was stress. I have a whole lot less now. So when you first enter retirement, a lot of times you can become more stressed than you were on the job because um, it, it's a whole new atmosphere for you. You don't know what to do with yourself. So getting yourself a nice little hobby to kind of calm and relax you um, is going to be really beneficial for you. You can do things like um, yoga or meditation. Those are both really good for uh, mind Mind body re relaxation. Yeah, you could go fishing in the lake behind us. <laughs> no, it's off limits. It's a water reservoir for drinking. Engaging in activities that kind of help your body and your mind relax, um, such as reading or painting or even just taking a walk in nature, like we're doing today. Gardening, for example, could help your stress level immensely by the fact that you're concentrating on taking care of your plant and not worrying about paying your bills mm. or something similar to that. Mm. And nobody likes paying their bills. Mm -mm. Bills are no bueno. No. So number two benefit to having hobbies in retirement is keeping yourself socially active. When you retire, you're no longer going to work every day. You don't meet the same people who have been in your lives, your work lives for a long time. And uh, your sphere of people grows really small, like down to your spouse. That's it. Just you and him. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Which sometimes, you know, that might not be a bad thing. Because you both have been married for a long time and you know each other's routine. But you can get tired of your spouse if that's all you got day in and day out. Some hobbies that might help you stay socially active are um, joining a dance club or a book club or taking up photography and meeting other people who like to do the same things that you do. A great way to stay socially active when you're in retirement is to volunteer. That's a great hobby for a lot of people. They spent so many years working and raising a family that they didn't have time to volunteer. And now that you're retired, maybe you do. Maybe you go out and, and find your favorite charity and go and spend a few hours there every week. So the third benefit of hobbies is it keeps you physically active. So maybe a hobby of yours is uh, bird watching. Well, you're getting out there and getting on the boardwalk and the reserve and yeah, what Red is doing, <laughs> except use regular binoculars. <laughs> Birdies. Birdies. <laughs> Gardening. Gardening is a great physical hobby to have in retirement because you're out there digging and hoeing and fetching oh. and carrying and weeding and twisting and bending. Oh, Kneeling, yeah. standing. Pruning. Pruning is really good. <laughs> Gee, like that with the prunes. <laughs> Golfing. Who likes to golf? Not me. 
It's really good for keeping you active, though. It I mean, is. You, you got the swing. And then we're running after the ball. And you got the twist. Oh, yeah. Twist so flex. <laughs> Having pets is a great hobby. You can take your dog for a walk. It gets you outside. Chick magnet. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so you want a pretty dog. We'll get one of those ugly ones. Actually, it doesn't really matter. It does not matter. No, people love dogs, so. Yep, it's always a great conversation starter, too. If you don't know how to talk to people, so, you know, maybe you've been in data entry your entire life and you never actually talk to people. Dogs are a great conversation starter. One of my favorite things to do when we're vacation is, can I pet your dog? And now you've gotten into a conversation with someone you totally don't know. If you're enjoying our video about the benefits of having hobbies in retirement, please hit the thumbs up button and go ahead and hit the subscribe button too. What kind of hobbies do you have? Let us know in the comments below. Benefit number four to having hobbies in retirement is mental stimulation. Some of the ways you can keep your mind sharp when you're in retirement is to do crossword puzzles or learn a new language. Playing um, games on your uh, phone. Figuring out how to do a YouTube video. That is really <laughs> mental stimulation right there. Even word find. Word find. I yeah. like word find. I've been doing that for a long time. Benefit number five is learning new skills. Your hobbies can teach you all kinds of new things. Depending on the hobby, your body can learn new movements, such as if you're learning how to line dance. Or yoga. Or yoga. When you pick up a new hobby in retirement, you're almost definitely going to learn new skills. Uh, if you've never done photography before and you decide that you're going to take up photography as a hobby, you're definitely going to learn some new skills. Benefit number six, an opportunity to make money. Hmm. Most people don't realize how poor you're going to be in retirement because <laughs> you're not going to have the same kind of funds that you had when you were working, and it really sucks. It's one of my biggest disappointments in retirement. Yeah, no kidding. So, you know, you may be thinking, okay, how can I make a, just a little bit of cash on the side in retirement? Well, put your hobbies to work. Lynn started a new hobby of uh, making walking sticks, and he's got some up for sale, and, you know, it's not going to make us rich, but, you know, hopefully it'll... Bring in a little extra income now and then. And I've been, for about seven years now, I've been dabbling in reselling. So, buy low, sell high, and make a little money that way. And Another hobby in retirement that might make you some money if you become good at it is photography. A lot of people make money off of photography. Or if you're an excellent chef... Uh, Put your skills out there and go cook a family a meal once a week or something. Ooh, that's a great idea. I got them. And I if you're really good at a certain hobby that you have, you can always become a consultant to someone else and teach them how to do it. Number seven benefit to having hobbies in retirement is to prevent boredom. Nobody wants to be bored in, in retirement. That makes you sit around and get fat and old and stiff. Nobody wants that. No. And you're already getting old, so your body's already going those directions anyway. You're just trying to slow it down some and stay as healthy as you can. Unfortunately, a lot of people look forward to retirement, and they think that retirement is um, basically sitting around and being a couch potato. Um I think that invites boredom, and that's not something I ever want to do. I like being engaged. We have couch potato days, <laughs> and they're pretty nice, but we have a lot more days where we just go out and do different things, and I love to be outside. I've worked my whole life outside, so I find something outside to do. I mean, there's always yard work, and in the house, there's always housework, and nobody likes to do that, but you're not bored when you're doing it. And you're exercising. And today we are combining video making 
which is a hobby, with another hobby of ours, which is getting out into nature. We have this beautiful backdrop we drove up into the mountains to find so that we could uh, share it with you today. And our dog's right over here in the truck because somebody up here is enjoying their hobby of shooting guns and it's scaring him to death. So he's just hunkered <laughs> down in the truck. Until the next video, <clears throat> take care, be safe. And remember, when you're retired, it's always five o'clock.